Hello everybody, Rich here at the Ultra Motorsports Warehouse. We are doing a virtual walk around today for uh, a customer looking at our 1975 Volkswagen Beetle and as with all of our walk arounds, quick disclaimer, what they lack in production value as I've always said make up for and transparency. So you're gonna see everything that's going on with the car, uh, every little nick, every little scratch that I can see, I'll walk around the car just like I'm the one buying it, okay? So uh, let's start here at the um, passenger side front and let's just look at the condition of the chrome and some of the rubber and stuff like that around here, okay? Uh, chrome all looks very, very nice. Uh, this is just dirt. Chrome could be brought back to you know, near perfect condition with just a little bit of steel wool. Uh, this spot on the chrome we may want to work on a little bit. You'd want to call me and see if we can make that look any better before um, you assume that um, that uh, that is just a smudge. You know, that looks like some pitting to me maybe. Um, I can send a picture after I've tried some steel wool on it and see how it looks, okay? Front bumper looks good. Uh, bezels all look great. Very obvious to me this car was um, uh, has had a repaint and it looks very very nice very tidy everywhere okay chrome bezels look good all this was obviously out at the time of uh, at the time of it being painted I don't see any nicks chips scratches any blemishes in the front of the car all this looks um, very tidy and very nice okay uh, no drips no orange peel nothing like that all this trim looks very very good also okay uh, moving around the car well, we'll do a quick look in the wheel wells here, just so you can see. As you can see, it uh, looks very clean, okay? No rust. Looks uh, very, very nice. Okay? So, yeah, I mean, not, not all, not bondoed up, not patched up, not rusted. Uh, all the wheels look great. Uh, center caps look very good, not dented, dinged, nothing like that. Uh, these lowers here, you know, where you would expect maybe some, some bubbling or something. I mean, this looks, this looks very, very nice. Sounds very good too. I don't expect that there's any bondo or anything like that in there. Um, all this looks very, very good. Yeah, I don't see any overspray really or any, um, anything super tacky looking. Looks very nice. Very good. So, uh, down the body line of the car, no dents, no dings. Looks very clean, very nice. All this stainless trim looks very good. Chrome mirrors, uh, no pitting. You know, um, hit them with a little steel wool. They'll probably look like brand new. Along the um, window trim here, this all looks very nice. I don't. Uh, none of this is all dinged up or chewed up. Looks very good. The window glass looks great. Back window uh, no, looks good. No scratches. All the stainless trim. There's no dents or dings or tings or anything like that. I do get a little tape line here. Um, so there's a little tape line here. So maybe this window wasn't out when the car was painted. Maybe these weren't either. I don't see any tape lines along this back window, but. Maybe these sides weren't taken out when the car was painted. Very, very, very minor. I mean, I don't know, you know, I'm standing five feet away from the car and don't see anything that's of any concern. So, no bubbles, no uh, blemishes in the paint. All the rear rear fenders look, um, or rear, rear quarters look great, rear fenders here. Um, all this in here looks very good. I don't see any rotten areas. Kind of see this. Looks really good, really nice. Very impressed. So um, this hubcap looks very nice. Maybe one you can see a little ding in the center cap as I move my camera back and forth. A little stone ding right there. Keep in mind, guys. I mean, I, you know, perfect cars are few and far between. They're a myth, you know, especially for, you know, fourteen thousand bucks. You know, so I mean, um, it, it, take 
be serious and compare my description of this car and what the way I'm looking at it. Compare it to another car you're looking at because you're going to see a lot of the same stuff. I mean, the, you know, these cars, it's very hard to over restore them. You don't want to, you can't over restore them because they're just not worth very much money. So that's the that's the issue. Um, I do have a small paint bubble right here. Kind of see it right here. there small bubble little blister five feet away from the car from all angles virtually unnoticeable I get uh, six eight inches away from the car and now you can start to see it so just a little um, for your information okay rear bumper looks great I don't see any issues with the rear bumper at all all the chrome looks like it's very nice come back nicely all these gaskets look great this is a great looking car great driving car um, really really fun looking uh car that just you know it's just always going to be worth what it's worth i mean that's that's what i think so fuel injected obviously for 1975 let's get a good look in this engine compartment and see real tidy real nice wouldn't be afraid at all to raise the hood of the car or excuse me raise the engine cover at a car show at all i mean looks real good so Gaps are good. Look at the gap here. Look at the gap here. Really pretty nice. Dents, dings. I don't see anything uh, on this side of the car that's uh, really worth mentioning. All the gaskets look good over here. Kind of against the wall here, but let's look. Let's get in here and look. Okay. You can see way back in there. Everything looks nice. Oops. looks good no bubbles no blemishes again another small tape line right here you can see easily a detail could could take this off I mean I you know you can we could get this cleaned up just a little bit so it looked just a little bit better um, just with my pen here so I mean don't Please don't let that dissuade you from, excuse me, from purchasing this car. It's a very, very nice condition, very nice car. So, uh, on the roof, <coughs> I mentioned there was one touch up on the roof about the size of a quarter. That's this right here. You can see it's been touched up. Okay. I can give you a quote to do a little bit better job than this if you'd like. Um, I can give a quote to blend it and make it all look look great. My guess is. Uh, five six hundred bucks and I could have just this roof kind of blended and painted in the right the same color as the car you never notice it very very you know not super noticeable as it is but definitely want to be aware that it's there okay got it okay uh, driver's door driver's mirror all look great all the trim around the windows looks great. Trim down the side of the car, great. No door dings, everything looks good. Let's take a poke uh, in the front fenders here. Wow, really nice. Really, really nice. Way better than driver quality in my opinion, okay? Way better than that. Hubcaps look good. Hubcap on the rear look good. Um, let's look in the bonnet here. Read the description on this car too on the on the website. This uh, uh, this car has had a lot of work done. I mean, a lot of brake work, disc brakes in the front, whole braking systems have been gone through, fuel injection been gone through again. Made more just to this is made to be a car that can be driven around all over the place. I mean, definitely a great lake car, great beach car, great weekend car, fun car. Go to a car show, probably still bring home a trophy at a car show and drive the car all the way there. This was how this car was made for. Okay, disc brakes. Um, really, really nice running, driving car that looks very, very, very presentable. I mean, very good. So, really, really um, just a nice looking piece. Let's look on the inside here. Weather stripping all looks brand new. Door panel, brand new, looks like. Uh, these seats look like brand new, okay? 
seats are in excellent condition. Um, back here, uh, you know, a little, a few little check marks there in the material. You can see that looks original to me. I believe I have the replacements for this though, also. And then here on this side, you can see in the pictures, this definitely needs, needs repaired or replaced. Okay, looks like probably originals or something needs taken care of. Uh, looks like an updated stereo system. Uh, headliner is excellent. And let's move on to uh, the dash and carpets, floorboards, etc. So um, floorboards, very nice. Everything looks very period correct with just some really subtle, subtle styling stuff. Like I said, it, this car is made to have fun with. It's made to drive around on the weekends, have a great time with. Door panel looks good. All these arm uh, top door panels look good. The metal painted work looks excellent. I mean, very nice. Headliner good. Sun visor is good. Okay. Um, Seatbelt snapped. Uh, clutch. And. Oops, excuse me. Okay, there it is, cold start right there. Car started right up, fired up no problem. This car probably hasn't ran in a month. So, very pleased with this thing. Really nice driving car, running and driving well. Odometer shows uh, 37.93 and 7 tenths. So, um, yeah, real nice piece. Nice stereo, upgraded stereo. Dash looks great. box all stock looks very nice um, steering wheel one little split right here okay but overall just I mean really nice car okay really fun car somebody's really getting a lot of, a lot of bang for their buck with this piece okay um, I wouldn't be afraid to take this car on the highway or you know let your uh, wife, girlfriend, etc., drive it around because it's just extremely reliable and a, a really, really nice looking piece. So, great car, guys. 1975 uh, Volkswagen uh, Beetle, fuel injected, red over white interior, uh, little baby moon hubcaps on it. Uh, standing pretty tall, really. Look us up on the web if you have any questions, ultramotors.net. You can reach me through the website. My name is Rich uh, if you have any additional questions, okay? Thanks a lot.